नमस्कार टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द मैथमेटिक्स पेपर ऑफ पीरियडिक टेस्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ क्लास थर्ड इन दिस पेपर वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द फॉर्मेट ऑफ क्वेश्चन पेपर एंड हाउ टू सॉल्व इट एज यू कैन सी हियर द फ्रंट पेज ऑफ द पेपर इज हियर क्लास इज ऑलरेडी मैंशन वॉट यू हैव टू मैंशन इज सेक्शन इन केस यू हैव सेक्शन यू कैन राइट the section name a b c d accordingly now you have to write the students name always try to write the name in capital letter and try to write your full name after that what you have to write is the roll number whatever is assigned by your class teacher next You have to write the exam date. Suppose uh, the exam is on 20 July. What I will write? It, I will write 27, 22, like that. Now you can see here the paper is divided in four parts: knowledge, understanding, ability to compute, and problem-solving ability. Each carrying 10 marks each. So first we will solve the knowledge part. Here you can see the first questions. Write the number in figures. Here, the number's name is there, 105. What you have to write is, you have to write the number in figure 105 like this. 512, same pattern. You have to follow 512. The next one, write the given number in words. It is exactly opposite of the previous questions. 432 you have to write here 432 like that the next question is 605 you have to write 605 like that you can continue this one the next questions write the correct views of the following objects you can see here one pressure cooker is here and another chair is there pressure cooker whether this is the top view this is the side view you have to write and you can see here uh, this is the top view so what you have to write here is top view top view if we will see the pressure cooker from the top it will look like this and the chair it is of course it is the side view if we look a chair from the side it will look like this so you have to write the type of views top view and side views now we are moving to the next part guess these words by looking at their halves and complete it you can see here what you have to do is you have to complete this word by drawing their halves so uh, let me try to solve uh, this one for you you can see here it is half is given what we have to do is we have to draw the half you can do the shadow also like this it's half is there and we will move further as and this one if you will going to complete it will look like so the word here you can see the word is w h and o so very simple word is there w h o who now we are going to complete the another word half is given and half you have to draw half you have to 
draw like this in this way it's b it's o it's another o and this one is this one is k so the word here you can see here the word here is it's book so in this way you can uh, complete the words now we are moving to the next section of understanding complete the following number patterns you have to understand the sequence of the number what is asked for here you can see first number 790 then 780 then 770 means from 790 if we will minus 10 it will look 780 in that case again if we will do the minus 10 then it will be 770 so 770 minus 10 it will be 760 like this way you can write 750 same things 52 54 52 54 56 here 2 is added you can see here the number 2 is added here so 56 plus 2 it is 58 58 plus 2 it is 60 the next one again you can see here 2 2 is added 112 plus 2 114 plus 2 116 means plus 2 is here also so what we will write here 116 plus 2 118 118 plus 2 120 in the next pattern again you can see 270 to 280 it's a plus 10 like that 280 to 90 it's plus 10 so what we have to do is you have to write 290 plus 10 it's 300 means here we are adding the 10 like this if we will add another 10 to 300 it will be 300 and 10 in this way you have to understand the pattern and you can continue the numbers like this now the next one complete the following figures to make rectangle and triangle here i will suggest one strong point here please use scales whenever you are drawing something in the paper so you have to complete this rectangle by joining the dots you have to join the dots properly and try to use the scale for proper line you can use the scale here for straight lines I am unable to use the skill here in this uh, software but you are supposed to use the skill the next one you can see here you have to complete this rectangle two side is already there okay now the rectangle is complete triangle is complete in this way you can complete the rectangle and triangle now we are moving to the next one find the numbers by calculating the shapes it is a question of uh, counting you can see here here different objects are there one is 100 100 and three tens are there 100 three tens and three ones are also there means the number will be 100 three tens three ones it's 133 like this here you can see 200 is there so what we will write first 2 10 you can see here only one ten is there you can see one only one ten is there so what we will write here 1 and here you have to count the 1 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so it will be 270 the next one you can see here here 300 100 200 and 
300, 2 tens, 300, 2 tens, 1, 1, 300, 2 tens and 1, 1. So, it will be 321. Now, we will move to the next section that is ability to compute. Here the pattern is there, but here the instruction is given jump 5 steps backward, jump 5 steps backward. What you have to do is you have to move back 190 minus 5, it is 185. Like this, 185 minus 5, 180. 180 minus 5, it will be 175. 175 minus 5, it will be 170. 170 minus 5, it will be 165. 165 minus 5, it will be 160. Like that. Now, the next one, 5 steps forward. 110 plus 5, it is 115. 115 plus 5, 120. 120 plus 5, it will be 125, 125 plus 5, 130, 130 plus 5, 135, 135 plus 5, it will be 140. Now, the next question you can see, how many marks do the students need to score 100? Here you can see three students are there, Pushi, Shreya and Rahul. And what you have to do is, you have to, first you have to know the score. Kusi has scored 91, Sreya has scored 99, Rahul has scored 95. And how many score they needed to complete 100? Yani, Kusi has scored 91, but we have to write that how many score numbers she needs more for 100. So it will be, 100 minus 91, you can uh, do the rough here also at any place. Suppose you have to, you can do here 100 minus 91. So it will be 10 minus 1, it will be 9 and it will be 0. Means it is already 0, 0. So it will be 9 marks. Kusi needs 9 marks to be equal to 100. Like that, Sreya is in 99. So she needs only 1 marks. Rahul is in 95, she needs only 5 marks to equal to 100. So, this is the question one. Next one, mess with the number. It is one type of riddles you can see here. One is solved here. I come between 40 and 50 and there is a 5 in my name. In between 40 and 50, the number switch H15 is nothing but the word number 45. So, the 45 you can see here it is given already. Like that you have to solve all other questions. I have 9 in my name and I am very close to 90. I have one 9 and I am very close to 90. The close numbers of 90 are whether it is 89 or 91. And you can see here 89 is already given. So, it will be 89 and you can see here 89 has a 9 also. The next one, if you hit a 4 after me, you score a century. If you will hit a 4 after me, you will hit a century. Means century is here 100 and uh, if you will hit a score uh, of 4, means 100 minus 4, it is no doubt it is 90. 6. Next one, I am equal to 10 nodes of 10. 10 nodes of 10 in means 10 into 10. It will be 100. It will be 100. So, you can see here, the question is very simple here. I am century plus half century. Century means 100. Half century means 50. So, century plus half century it is 100 plus 50 and it will be 100 plus 50 it will be what it will be 150 next one 
I'm exactly between 77 and 97. 77 and 97. You can see here 77, 97. In between there, it is 87. So it will be 87. Now we will move to the last section that is problem solving ability. Fill in the blanks 37 plus dash equal to 47. It is one type of indirect question 37 plus dash equal to 47. What you have to do means what we will add in 37 which will become 47. So what you have to do is you can do the rough here 47 minus 37. 7 minus 7 it's 0. 4 minus 3 it is 10. So the answer will be 37 plus 10 equal to 47. In order to check the question, you can do the same thing also 37 plus 10 equal to 47, whether it is right or not, you can do the rechecking 37 plus 10, 7 plus 7, 7 plus 0 is 7, 3 plus 1 it is 47. So the answer is right here, you can see here it is also 47. 4 and 37 more, 4 and 37 more, you have to understand the word here more. More means plus. So, what you have to do is 37 and 4 you have to add. You have to add 37 plus 4. 7 plus 4, 1. 3 plus 1, 4. 41. You have to write here 41. Now, we will move to the next one. Write the number of objects in the blanks. You can see here bundles are there. The bundles of sticks, 100, 100, 200, 300, and 110, 300, 300, 110, and the loose sticks will count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 319 sticks are there. Here, like blocks also, it is 100, it is 200, it is 10. Yeah, means uh, uh, 200 one tens and the single unit one or two 200 one tens two one so 212 blocks are there in total now we are moving to the next one write the place and place value place in this face value exactly uh, you have to write the face value here face value of underlined digit 6. The 6 is underlined here. So, see face value of 6 is it is no doubt 6. It is no doubt 6. But the place value, if you can see 500, 6 tens, 2 ones, 6 tens, 6 tens mean it is 60. So, the place value of 6 is here, it is 60. Here you can see small correction is there. It is the face value. Next one, the rabbit jumps on every third box and the kangaroo jumps on every fifth box. Here you can see the rabbit is jumping on each th third box and the kangaroo jumps on every fifth box. The rabbit starts jumping from two and the, ra the rabbit is now on fifth jump. The rabbit starts jumping from two and it is at present at fifth jump. 2, you can see here, the rabbit will start jumping from 2 to every third. 1, 2, 3. First, the rabbit will reach here. Then, 1, 2, 3. Next, reach here. Fifth jump. We have to find the fifth jump. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. Fifth jump. 1, 2, and 3. Fourth jump. 1, after that uh, from 15, we will move to the this one, we will move to the 1, 2 and 1, 2 and 3, 14 to 15, 15 to 16, 16 to 17. So, it, now the rabbit will be at fifth jump, first, at first jump, the rabbit is at uh, the first jump, it is the second jump, it is the third jump, it is the fourth jump and 
this is the fifth term so the rabbit at the fifth term will be at 17 so the number the rabbit will be on after fifth jump it will be 17 and the kangaroo starts jumping from four and the kangaroo is on its third jump but the kangaroo jump on every fifth place and the kangaroo will start jumping from fourth right so we will differentiate a different color here for kangaroo kangaroo will jump from four and on fifth so first one two three four five so this is the first jump of kangaroo first jump and next one one two three four five so this is the fifth jump 14 is the fifth jump the next one second jump sorry the next one one from here we have to find the third place here uh, one it's uh, two three four and five 19 so on third jump kangaroo will be at 19 the kangaroo will be at 19 so in in your paper the jump the uh, numbers jump it may come in different formats so you can you have to understand the question properly to solve the question so that's all for uh, today's discussions you can watch this video uh, and you can practice accordingly at home you can see here after solving all you have to check whether you have completed all the questions or not you can erase the rock work also from the inside suppose you can erase uh, the rock work also but if you have done rock work in specified space no need to erase the work so that's all for today's in the next video we will come with another subjects and we will cover the entire question format for the upcoming examination so all the best